As you can see, we have X-Ray on, on Minecraft 1.20. I went ahead and put myself in creative so you guys could see that this is in game. This is me, this is my skin. And this is 1.20. As of right now, this is on the snapshot, but this will work with Minecraft 1.20 once 1.20 is already out, fully out. So if you wanna learn how to add X-Ray to Minecraft 1.20, as well as how to add X-Ray to Minecraft 1.20 snapshots as of now, then make sure to watch this video until the end and let's get started with the tutorial. Okay, so the first step to getting X-Ray in Minecraft, well, it's down Downloading the X-ray. So in order to download the X-ray, go ahead and click on the second link in the description, which will bring you to, of course, our written guide on how to download and install the X-ray. Of course, feel free to read through the guide and look at the screenshots if that helps some of you. But I'm assuming most of you just want to follow along the video. So what you're going to do is click on the button that says download X-ray. Just go ahead and scroll down and click where it says download X-ray. That is going to redirect you to the CurseForge website. In here, you're going to look for your desired version of X-ray. And I know some of you might be saying something like, whoa, there is not 1.20. What are you doing with your life? There's not 1.20. I know that you might look in here and you might be confused because the most recent version is 1.19.1. However, you can trust me when I say that 1.19.1 is completely compatible with 1.20 as you will see in this video. So go ahead and click on these little three dots that appear on the right and click download file next to the 1.19.1. Of course, if you're watching this in the future and there is a 1.20 version, well, go ahead and download the 1.20. But as of now, this is the newest one. So go ahead and download whatever the most recent one is. Click download file after you click on these little three dots that is going to redirect you over here, where in five seconds, the download will start automatically. Let's go ahead and wait for those five seconds. And as you can see, the file is now downloading. In my case, it's asking me where I wanna save the file, but for most of you, it's just going to download it right away and it's going to go to your downloads folder. Once you have located your file, go ahead and drag and drop it into your desktop. If you're using Chrome, you could click on this little arrow on the top right and go ahead and drag and drop the most recent file that you just downloaded, the X-Ray Ultimate, into your desktop. Now, we're going to add the X-Ray into Minecraft. So go ahead and launch your Minecraft launcher. Once the Minecraft launcher has opened, go ahead and launch Minecraft 1.20. In this video, we're gonna use the latest snapshot, which is 1.20 pre-release four, but this tutorial will work with Minecraft 1.20. And trust me when I say it will work, because if it doesn't work in the future, I wouldn't have it out, trust me. Okay, so once you have your Minecraft 1.20 selected or the snapshot, if you're watching this as of now, go ahead and click on play, right? And wait for that to open. And we're gonna wait for that to open and I will see you inside the game. So as you can see, Minecraft 1.20 has opened. As you can see down here, it says Minecraft 1.20. This is a pre-release, but again, it will work with the full game once it's already out. What you're going to do is go ahead and launch any world that you want. And also keep in mind that X-Ray does work on multiplayer. However, I don't recommend you use it on a public server unless you have permission from that server. Another way you can use X-Ray on multiplayer is if you're on your own server. And if you don't own your own server, you could actually create one by using the first link in the description to get 25% off your first server with Apex Hosting. The great thing about Apex Hosting is that they will take care of the setting up for you and they will create either a Java or a Bedrock server, whatever you choose, and this server will be open 24 seven. Your friends could join and you could use your X-Ray with no issue. Nobody could ban you because it is your server. Something that is really cool with Apex Hosting that I personally love is that you could access a server console through your phone. So you could be far away from home and you could access a server console and do whatever you need. So I'm gonna leave that first link in the description for those of you that wanna take advantage of the 25% off your first server with Apex Hosting. And after that beautiful transition to our sponsor, let's go back into adding the x-ray so like i said if you want to use it on a multiplayer make sure you own the server or you have permission if not we're gonna go to single player we're gonna create a new world right i'm just gonna create it real quick so you guys could see that this works i'm gonna put it on creative so we could actually fly around and make it easier so now we are inside a world and as you can see we have no x-ray how do we add the x-ray well it's pretty simple go ahead and press escape and once you press escape go ahead and click where it says options once in here go ahead and click where it says resource packs in the resource packs, you're gonna click where it says open pack folder, and that is going to bring you over here where you're probably going to have an empty folder, right? Let's assume that you have an empty folder. I went ahead and deleted the stuff I had in there. In this folder, all you have to do is drag and drop the file we downloaded earlier, the X-Ray Ultimate. Go ahead and drag and drop that into there. And now you could go ahead and close this folder, go back into the game, and now we're gonna click in this little arrow. And I know that it says incompatible, right? You might be saying, well, if it says incompatible, it's not gonna work. It is still going to work, okay? So just go ahead and click on this little play arrow right here. Click yes, it's saying that this is made for an older version. It might not work, but it will work. Go ahead and click on yes, click on done, and just wait for that to load. And as you can see, my friends, X-Ray is working on 1.20. Now, a couple of things that you need to keep in mind. As you can see, as of now, the um, ores are a little bit dark, right? So as you can see, unless you increase your brightness all the way up, the ores will be a little bit dark. So 
what do you do to fix that? Well, you have the legal way, which is by crafting a night vision potion, right? So, so for example, let's say that you craft a night vision potion. As you can see, you will see all the ores, right? We're seeing there that we could see all the ores. I'm actually gonna put myself in a spectator mode real quick so we could go deeper and you guys could see, oh my God, my computer is about to explode. But as you can see, we could see all the ores if we go into a spectator mode, right? That is one way to fix it. And that's the legal way. Another way that you could do it, which is not illegal, but I, I don't know why I said it that way. It's by installing Optifine. However, there's no Optifine 1.20 for the snapshot. And I don't know in the future if by the time you're watching this video, Optifine 1.20 is out already. However, you could always check on this channel because as soon as a new Optifine comes out, we make a video on it. So if Optifine 1.20 is already out, we will have a guide for that here on the channel and you will be able to fix the dark problem with the ores in order to see them all. So that's the second way to fix it. Another way that you could fix it is by maybe downloading some custom shaders or some custom resource packs that make your ores shine in the dark so that's something that you could look up yourself and download it as well but what i recommend is that you install optifine we have videos on the channel as soon as the new optifine comes out we make a video on how to install optifine and that will fix the night vision problem for you anyways that is pretty much how to download and install x-ray for minecraft 1.20 and 1.20 snapshot i hope you enjoyed this video if the tutorial was useful don't forget to let me know down in the comments and as always bye bye